The 1979 French Grand Prix was a seismic moment for Formula One, as a turbocharged car won for the first time in history. Renault pioneered F1 turbo engine technology in 1977. But it didn't always go according to plan, and its car was nicknamed the Yellow Teapot due to its regular failures. In 1979, the RS10 chassis was able to exploit all the potential, its breakthrough coming in the French Grand Prix at Dijon Prenois. Jean-Pierre Jabouy set pole position, but was beaten away from the start line by the Ferrari of Gilles Villeneuve. Villeneuve led for 46 laps, but ran out of tyre grip and brakes, so Jabouy passed him. Jabouy went on to claim the first ever victory for a turbo-powered F1 car. Behind him, all eyes were on the battle for second, between Villeneuve and the second Renault of René Arnoux. The pair passed and repassed each other, banging wheels in one of the most intense duels in F1 history. Villeneuve won the intense battle by 0.24 seconds and said later, I never enjoyed a race more. Jabouy was also the first Frenchman to win his home race since Jean-Pierre Wimieux in 1948. Turbocharged F1 engines would go on to win many more Grand Prix. <laughs>